Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am coming at you with my week 34 update of my fitness journey and with wet hair because like what's new? That's just how we're rolling on the channel, I guess. I feel like every time I film, it's always when I have wet hair, like I've just gotten out of the shower. I am just going to run through what I did this week. I'm honestly surprised that I've pulled myself together enough to actually work out. So um, like normal, I'm just gonna tell you guys what I've done, give you a little update, which is so exciting. And it's something that is like pretty cool just for myself. And then we'll move on to the progress photos. Also, I will include the thumbnail on the screen so you guys can see which videos I actually did. So starting off Saturday, I did nothing. Um, I normally don't work out on Saturdays, um, just that's just become a thing. But last Saturday was my cousin's wedding and I was actually pretty active. We did this dance. If you haven't seen the video, I'll link it down below. But we did a dance that was pretty hardcore workout uh, for like five minutes. I did a lot of standing and heels. I feel like I just got a good amount of exercise for Saturday and I didn't eat a whole lot, which is not good, but also we were like super busy getting ready and everything. Sunday, I did nothing, so there's no footage there. Monday is when we traveled home and I just did one video because I really didn't want to work out guys, but it was one of those things where I just didn't want to get out of the total swing of things. So I just did the Pamela Reef 20 minute full body beginner workout because I didn't want to go too hardcore and I actually just kept my clothes on from what I wore driving back to Florida. So it was just like, you know, I'm just gonna go hardcore for 20 minutes and then I'm gonna be done. Then on Wednesday, I did the 20 minute intense full body workout. One of my favorites. I think this was the very first workout I tried by Pamela and I was really impressed by it. So I've just kept doing it. Then I did the 10 minute abs and then I did the 10 minute cool down. And I really liked that one um, just because I wanted something, but I didn't want to keep working out, but I wanted to do something else just so I could get like a good around 30 minute workout in on Wednesday. And then today, Friday, I did the day three of the hardcore uh, sweaty 45 minute workout. And this is, I believe week 26, but again, I'll just put the picture on the screen so you guys can see. So it includes the head and heart workout, which is really short. It's only like five minutes. And then I did the 10 minute abs. That's the same 10 minute abs I did on Wednesday. Then she had us do both of the 10 minute hit workout, which is the hardest workout I've ever done. And I still can't really get through it um, without taking like a break or whatever. And then I did the 10 minute calorie burner. I think this was like for the medium level and that's a pretty good workout. And then I did the abs and yoga because that was the last workout in this little program she has put together. So overall, that is what I did this week. Pretty chill, pretty laid back. Um, but honestly, I really wanted to like rest because I just didn't want to work out, but I just pushed myself to the limits that I think or I thought I could handle and it went pretty well. Moving on to the updates. Okay, so I don't know if this is like, will trigger anyone, but it's part of the thumbnail. So I hope you guys aren't offended or whatever, but <laughs> I don't know. I wanted to share it just because it was something fun. And to me, I just, you know, want to appreciate how far I've come. And so I tried on one of my cousin's pageant ball gown dresses and she has done, this is the cousin that got married. I have a lot of cousins but this is the cousin that got married and she has so many fun dresses so I played dress up a little bit and um, it doesn't really matter the size but I'm just gonna say it was a size 2 dress and I couldn't believe I actually like squeezed myself in that dress because I've never really been a size two ever in my life. I've always had boobs and a butt and I love my figure so much. Um, I wouldn't trade it for anything because I really like the way I look, but also I've worked really hard and I was like, oh, I really want to try this style of dress because I absolutely love this style of dress and it should be on the screen right now so you guys can see it, but I love it. So I said um, when I was in South Carolina, like I need to try on that dress. So my aunt, she like got out the dress and we kind of like had this little dress up thing. Um, my cousin was on her honeymoon, so she wasn't there, but I tried on all this stuff and it was really cool. And I couldn't believe I like fit in the dress and it made me feel really confident. And it was just so cool. In some of the photos, you can 
can see like my little like pouch here like my lower abs poking out just a little bit and I know that's being super nitpicky but um I honestly don't care and also like around my like waist area here like my rib area the dress was like actually kind of loose but like in my lower abs it was a little bit tight one moment hello and it was it felt normal pretty normal around like the bust area so overall I was really happy and I know that this is it sounds like superficial and everything but sometimes you just have to look at how far you've come and like have some fun and try on clothes that you normally don't try on because it's fun yeah so that is what I looked like to continue on with these little updates, uh, food-wise is terrible. Um, I'm just gonna be completely honest. I had fast food, I had cookies, I had alcoholic beverages this past weekend. Like when, you know, when you're away, you just pick out more than you do like in your normal life. So I'm just gonna overall say like I had fries, I had a lot of like greasy foods. I'm surprised that my stomach did not like reject a lot of that because I've been trying to stay pretty far away from like greasy heavy foods. Also too, uh, my birthday was on Tuesday. So we had cake and ice cream. I had like three Coke floats this past week. And then today my mom got me some Rice Krispie treats, which we all know. I love my Rice Krispie treats. So overall food wise, it's just like a no go. And again, like I've stated in other videos, which I hope you guys like stay and watch this part. I'm not gonna like change what I eat because that'll completely take away the whole fun of like this journey. And I don't wanna like give up my favorite foods just because of like looking good. Cause food is just amazing. <laughs> I really don't have any other updates, but I wanted to share that photo and say that I've been eating very poorly. That's why in the photos, I'm going to look like kind of bloated. These aren't photos I'm like that proud of, but you know, it's just journey and whatever. So Alex, the last week, is on the left and on the right is current Alex. And then here's the side view. Honestly, when you just eat like one bad food or you just eat not very well, like it really does show in your body and it changes like the way you feel. Cause after I ate like pretty poorly, like I felt it and I was like more lethargic and everything. Kind of like I am right now, but actually I ate pretty healthy today. Here is pre-workout Alex. So pre-workout Alex is on the left and then current Alex is on the right. And here is the side view of that. Yeah, so that is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys have been on a workout journey, try on clothes that you normally don't try on or wear and just like see how you look, see how you feel. It could like inspire you even more because like I was pretty inspired like after I tried on that dress because I'm like, I love this dress and I couldn't believe like I actually fit in it. <laughs> but yeah, so question of the day, what type of outfit is your favorite? Do you like jeans? leggings dresses rompers I would love to know give this video a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys in my next video bye